Alright guys, welcome back to Assassin's Creed, so let's talk to our bureau. Altair, That's you've caused want. quite a stir. I've done as requested. Sabran's life is ended. So it is. So it is. You should ride for Masiaf and inform Al Muallim of your success. Yes. I should return and speak to him. Of this and other things. Is everything alright, my friend? You seem distant. It's nothing, Rafi. Just a lot on my mind. Talk to me then. Let me help. I need to make sense of this myself first. But thank you for the offer. It is the men you kill, isn't it? You feel something for them. How? Ah, my friend. You are not meant to enjoy these grim tasks. Regret, uncertainty, sympathy. This is to be expected. I should not fear these feelings. You should embrace them. They are what keep you human. What if I'm wrong? What if these men are not meant to die? What if they mean well? Misguided, perhaps, but pure in motive. I am but a Rafiq, Altair, and such things are beyond me. Perhaps Al Mualim can help you to make sense of it. Yes, perhaps. Thank you, Rafiq. It is my pleasure to have served with one as skilled as you. All right. Come on. Nope. There we go. I think that's it. There we go. Forwarding memory to a more recent one. Alright, and now I should be able to fast travel, I believe. And we have one memory block left. Or, well, technically two. One assassination to do left. Which essentially evolves one city, so... Not a lot of time, Vic. Wherever it's hidden, time to retreat. Working on it. And when it's done, he'll be taken care of. I want that progress report by tomorrow morning. I've got some work I need to do. So you've got the rest of the night to yourself. <laughs> that was interesting. Uh. Can I interact? No interaction? Whatever. I'll just go to bed then, I don't care. All right. Sleep. The answers. The following morning. Time's wasting, Mr. Miles. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming. We're nearly done, you know. And then what? You'll see. Maybe they'll even let you watch when it begins. It's not as terrible as you think. Look, I know you're not gonna let me leave. So why not tell me what's going on? Humor me. I'm not an idiot, Mr. Miles. I think you've already learned quite a bit. I don't know what you're talking about. Of course not. All right, let me ask you something else then. Yes? Some of the stuff I'm seeing in the Animus, sometimes it seems wrong. Untrue, like the history is off somehow. It doesn't- It doesn't what, Mr. Miles? match up with what you read on an online encyclopedia? What your high school history teacher taught you? Let me ask you something. Do these supposed experts have access to secret knowledge kept hidden from the rest of us? There are books, letters, documents, all sorts of source material from back then. Some of it seems to contradict what the Animus is showing me. Anyone can write a book, and they can put whatever they want on its pages. Anything. Used to be, we thought the world was flat. Some people still do. Yes, and they publish books about it. Or that the moon landing was a hoax. I believe there's also a book claims the world was created in seven days. A bestseller, too. Where's this going, Doc? The point, I suppose, is that you shouldn't trust everything you hear, everything you read. What's that your ancestors said? Nothing is true. Everything is permitted. Yes, exactly. 
It's part of what makes the Animus so spectacular. There's no room for misinterpretation. There's always room. Touché, Mr. Miles. Now that I've answered your question, can we begin? Okay, then. That was interesting. Alright, interact. Didn't want him yelling at me again. Okay. Alright, look at this. White and blue all the way across. Except for these areas right here. Which that one is going to get filled up uh, during this memory block, so you know. Yay! Alright, memory block six. Ladders are a socially acceptable way to reach a rooftop. Climbing on buildings, however, is not. Ah, uh, this is going to be so good. I think I get throwing knives up to 15 now instead. As my upgrade. We have much to discuss. We are close, Altair. Robert de Sable is now all that stands between us and victory. It is his mouth gives the orders. His hand pays the gold. With him dies the knowledge of the Templar treasure, and any threat it might pose. I still don't understand how a simple bit of treasure could cause so much chaos. The peace of Eden is temptation given form. Merely look at what it's done to Robert. Once he tasted of its power, the thing consumed him. He saw not a dangerous weapon to be destroyed, but a tool. One that would help him realize his life's ambition. He dreamed of power then. Yes, and no. He dreamed, and still dreams, like us, of peace. But this is a man who sought to see the Holy Land consumed by war. No, Altair. How can you not see when you're the one that opened my eyes to this? What do you mean? What do he and his followers want? A world in which all men are united. I do not despise his goal. I share it. But I take issue with the means. Peace is something to be learned, to be understood, to be embraced. He would force it. And rob us of our free will in the process. Strange to think of him in this way. Never harbor hate for your victims, Altair. Such thoughts are poison and will cloud your judgment. Could he not be convinced then to end his mad quest? I spoke to him in my way through you. What was each killing if not a message? But he has chosen to ignore us. Then there's only one thing left to do. Jerusalem is where you faced him first. It's where you'll find him now. Let this final offering lend you strength. Go, Altair. It's time to finish this. Okay, give me my throwing knives or whatever the heck I'm getting. I want them. Oh, nope, nope, nope. Sword expertise and extra throwing knives. Cool. Alright. So now we gotta head into the kingdom. And we just gotta do that by running quite a bit of way. What the fool? Ah. So last memory block. I think I'm gonna be right, uh, because I did say this quite a long time ago. Is I think this is gonna be about a 75 to 80 video LP, somewhere around there, depending on how long the collection takes in Jerusalem and the missions as well. But I am pretty sure it will not be longer than 80. Which will, which will be cool, because I mean, I just finished uh, Dark Cloud about a week or so ago. Uh, Spyro and Morrowind are keep going, and so I'll be down to 2 LPs, which is actually what I want to do. 
Uh, I've been having a hard time trying to keep up with uh, four LPs. So, uh, having myself down to just Spyro and Morrowind will definitely help. So. Although Spyro will probably end in, uh, like, late April, early May, so. I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do to replace that. Alright. Nah, that's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to stay up. Whatever. Alright, so, to the kingdom. Actually, I think I'm going to fast forward straight to Jerusalem. Then leave Jerusalem to get to the uh, is crucial to your success. certain part that I Clear the to. area of archers and guards before confronting your assassination target. But, uh, yeah, I mean, this is gonna end soon. Uh, Assassin's Creed 2, I will probably do around maybe a month or two before Assassin's Creed 4 comes out. So, really depends on what other projects I end up having and uh, how much I can record during the summer. Okay, I actually want to go backwards. I want to go this way. And Kingdom. There we go. When you're out of knives, refill your stock by returning to Messiah, or by pickpocketing thugs. So this is going to be, uh, me just getting the flag that we need. So, I know it's going to be a pretty boring video, but it's really that all that I really can do. Okay, so. Pretty sure it's the, around there. I can't give a definite position. Really? But, you know what? They deserve that. I don't care. Okay. Okay, so. Well, we are actually going quite along. Uh, quite fast on the horse. Only a couple of seconds and we're already uh, 400 feet away. Okay, so I'm pretty sure I need to go up here, so... Yep. And turn. There we go. So it's in that gigantic, uh, like, broken-down fortress area. Which, yeah, it's in here. No? Ugh, stupid camera angle going the wrong way. Alright, now. No, 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 get, let me off, thank you. I actually need to do... Ah, uh, crap. That's not good at all. Okay, I need... To, yeah, I need to go up here. Up here. Around here. Super thing let me around the pillar. There. And then up here. All right. And so, whoa, almost fell off. That's not good. All right, here, and then the very last flag. Got it. And there we go. 100 out of 100 King Richard's flags.
And so that's going to be it, guys. Thanks for watching, and I shall see you back here for more Assassin's Creed, and I'll just fast forward uh, straight to Jerusalem. So uh, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.